having good skills helps you go places, helps you get out there and enjoy and explore the world. Hi, I'm Stuart. I'm the founder of Freedom Wheelchair Skills. Freedom Wheelchair Skills offers peer-led training of everyday skills so people can get the most out of life whilst using a wheelchair. Each training session with Freedom Wheelchair Skills is bespoke to that client. Before a training session is confirmed, I go through a series of questions with a client to work out their individual needs, goals and abilities. And this information helps me plan a training session bespoke to them to maximise the time spent training. Here's some feedback from some previous clients. I have a spinal cord injury at level T12 to L3. Um, I've just had a well my very first wheelchair skills training with Stuart. I really enjoyed it. I think a lot of the stuff that I learned is practical things that I'm going to be using every day or need to use every day. I've, I've shown his disease and the lumbar region on my back. It's been great today. I've got a lot out of it. I've learnt new tricks, some more confidence. Uh, I have MS and I also have a neck injury and arthritis. And today, uh, I've only really been using th this particular wheelchair for a couple of weeks, um, but I have been a wheelchair user for many years. However, this is right, really, really trying to work on my self-propelled skills. And today was uh, really brilliant from the point of view that Stuart was there and was able to watch what I was doing and actually help me with adjustments of how to get, get up curves and things like that. So yeah, it was really, really valuable. I would recommend that everyone goes on it if they're using a wheelchair, certainly if you're trying to self-propel. Um, and it gives you that feeling of independence of yes I can do this without having to ask someone else to help me all the time. So from that point of view, really definitely worth, worth it every penny. So yeah, great. Uh, I'm a T3 complete. Yeah, so today we've done an out and about with Freedom Wheelchair Skills with Stuart. It's been really good because I've actually done it in the home environment where I'm used to uh, living. And we've gone up and down curbs, through the park, around but it's perfect conditions for, for testing and just trying my ability. Today I got independence and feeling far more capable than when I arrived and I thought that I was quite capable anyway but I feel loads more capable now. Even just the slightest things that you show me like the banana move you know holding a cup that's made me feel far more capable and not like I'm stumbling along things and it was the back wheel balancing that I really wanted to get today and I've got it and it's great. <laughs> so thank you very much. Really good session, really enjoyed it. Yeah. Each time you use your wheelchair is a different scenario. Having good skills to be able to manage those environmental challenges makes all the difference on the journey. Taking on curbs, door thresholds and other environmental challenges with confidence makes getting around a lot easier. Battling against the camber on the path or in the road can be difficult sometimes. Here's a clip pushing along Worthing Seafront and you can see the left hand is doing less work than the right hand. Freedom wheelchair skills isn't just about wheelchair skills training, but peer support as well. Tip for getting um, 
cups out of the cupboard that you can't reach. Wooden spoon. In the handle. Easy job. Multiple sclerosis. And the skills that I've learned today is how to get about in a wheelchair, get up and down curbs, how to move about basically and get a bit of freedom from the illness that I've got. I'm a T10, complete paraplegic. Um, I've been in my wheelchair for five years and I've finally done some wheelchair skills with Stuart and it's been excellent. I've learned a wide range of skills, I'm going to be able to be far more independent um, and it's been a fantastic afternoon. Uh, I feel much more confident using my chair and I feel safer doing some new things and I'm looking forward to using the new skills, getting on and off a bus without help and using the underground more, getting over the gaps into carriages so I've got more confidence to do more things. Um, going up the curbs, learn how to get up the curbs, a lot more fluid than what I do at the moment. Um, the uh, going in and out of the cones, you know, Treating them as like objects on the floor and making sure that I'm not looking at them but also glancing down occasionally. Um, God, there's so much that we did today that I'm trying to remember. Um, we're going to be looking at um, going down steps as well. And um, yeah, we've done the curbs, going down the curbs on the back wheel balance, down the ramps, back wheel balance. And uh, yeah, lots, absolute lots. Yeah, re really worth it. I wanted to say that. Uh, that Stuart was very very encouraging very positive and that that is great and kept supporting me all the way through and uh, yeah it made me feel that I could do it that was a great feeling so, <laughs> taking on drop curbs with ease it helps improve the ride and even using a good skill to get over the blister pads makes all the difference